Hello! Just a short video today with a battery life test for the DJI NEO. I want to test the NEO at its leanest weight with no accessories and then do a comparison with some, we'll call them tacky accessories, attached to the drone and we'll see what the difference in battery life is. So you'll see from the photos that I've got a nice orange coloured gimbal slash camera guard on the front of the drone, some red bumpers on the sides and an accessory that serves absolutely no purpose wings on the back of the drone. Of course I've got the propeller guards on as well that are supplied with the drone. You might be surprised by the results and if you keep watching till the end I'll tell you exactly how much each accessory weighs. So this is the first of the two flights. This one has the accessories attached to the drone. We'll start the timer as soon as the drone takes off and I flew both these flights in normal mode using the RC2 controller and just flew a figure of eight pattern at no more than I think seven meters. Um, I flew until the drone had a forced landing on both flights and as soon as the drone landed that's when I stopped the timer. So I'll fast forward this to the end of the first flight. So as the drone comes into land after its first flight with the accessories attached, you'll see the low battery return to home promptly warning is on screen. It's been there since about 24, 25%. And then when the drone hits 10% battery, this low landing, uh, low battery landing warning appears. You then get a forced landing and progress warning on the left side of the screen. You can cancel it, however, I just let it run its course and the drone's landing itself here, I'm just moving it into a better position and as soon as it touches down and the grass stops moving when the props stop is when I stop the timer which is bang on 12 minutes um, which is 33% or a third less than the DJI quoted maximum flight time of 18 minutes which is not brilliant So this is the second flight with the naked Neo this time with no accessories attached. We'll take off and start the timer and again it's a figure of eight pattern flown until the drone came in to do a forced landing. Normal mode on the RC2 controller and I'll fast forward this again to save you watching the boring flight. So we've got the drone coming in nearing the end of its second flight now. You'll see the same warnings on the screen that the battery level is low and return to home promptly. And you will see on this occasion, as soon as this hits 11% battery, that you get this warning up, the low battery landing. So a percent less this time um, before it came up. So again, I just let the drone land and I positioned it into a, a better place for landing. I had a little wobble here, but ultimately came down safely. And again, as soon as the grass stops moving is when the propellers stop and that's when I stop the timer. So you'll see on this one, 13 minutes 26, so nearly a minute and a half extra but still miles off the DJI quoted maximum flight time of 18 minutes and I know it says that's in ideal conditions however I'm flying it here where there's no wind it's a nice calm day granted it's a bit cold it was eight degrees so that'll have some sort of impact on the battery life but four and a half minutes worth I would argue that that should not be the case Anyway, I digress. So, as promised, let's have a look at the weight of the accessories. So, the propeller guard that's included with the drone is 4.8 grams. The bumpers come in at 6 grams. The gimbal slash camera guard 
comes in at three grams and this piece of absolute complete and utter nonsense the wings come in at two grams so that is an increase in weight to the drone of 15.8 grams the drone itself is 135 grams so that is an increase in just shy of 12 percent in the weight of the drone does that equate to a minute and a half's worth of flying i don't know in any case if you have enjoyed this video if you've found it informative if you've found it entertaining or more likely the case a complete and utter waste of time please consider liking and subscribing and i will catch you on the next one cheers